Good morning, dear ladies and gentlemen. I take immense pleasure in welcoming you all to the 28th College Day Celebrations 2023. As we stand at the threshold of this gathering, it is time to unfold our horizons and rejoice in the simple pleasures that life has bestowed with. Music is an agreeable harmony for the honor of God and the permissible delights of the soul. O come, let us sing to the Lord. Let us make a joyful noise to the rock of our salvation. To enlighten us and brighten our souls, here comes our student's choir for the musical ecstasy. together to honor our heritage and language. I request everyone to stand up for Tamil Thai Vartu. Mm -hmm. 
Conquering God's reluctance, but laying holds of His willingness, says Martin Luther. Mark 11:24 says, "Therefore, I tell you, whatever you ask for in prayer, believe that you have received it, and it will be yours." Now I invite Reverend Gilden Dayanand, Director, Department of Communication, CAC Kanyakumari Diocese. To lead us in prayer. Rendal Sevo, Niana Turkum, Utukum, Uravida Mine and De Engel Waldwin, Elan Lekalayim, Asurvadite Nangal Pailaganda in the Kalurilum, Katukulavum, Tirchipuravum, Pudi Anabungalai Sondamaki Kulavum, Iravan Turkan, the main mayan, a Kirbikil Kahan and Diodo may put to Gondom. A Kaluri Nodaye, Irvati and Irvati Atav, Kaluri and Vadavale. Nangal wonder goody verabo Manorule Trangalai, member the Tikolabo Srapu Vrindan and Mula Mahe Alaman Samugatu Kuria, one maker like a Tukolabo Engel Aldo Makerai, Chame Padatikolabo, Yeravan Terrican, the main mayan, a Kirbehil Kain and Diodo may put to ground. In the Nalu Kuria Nikal will allow a tea master with the Taru Tamuda Yedu Yakaram, the Rai Wai Tangatom. In the Nikal will a Talamiate and Adathaganda, Engel de Kaluri Mudalver, Thalala. Matum would an Austria held Mano Manica Lari, Purpurta Kulum. Is Christopher Namatil Vendagrom, Ingalla Pidave. Ame. Thank you, dear Pastor. Fresh beginning always exists. We only have to welcome them. Now I call upon the organizing secretary, Dr. Shirley Kanagapriya, Assistant Professor of Department of Computer Science and Engineering to welcome the guests and the hosts. Respected correspondent, respected principal, respected chief guest, and other dignitaries on the dais and off the dais. A very good morning to all. Greetings to all in the sweet name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. It's a great pleasure and privilege for me to welcome you all for this auspicious occasion. First of all, I invoke our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, to bless and make this function a great success. I would like to welcome our Honorable Bishop of CSA Kanyakumari Diocese, Right Reverend Dr. A.R. Chalaya. Even though he is not able to attend this function because of his administrative works in the diocese, I welcome him in his absence here. At this juncture, I would like to welcome Reverend C. Gildan Dayanand, Director, Department of Communication, CSI Kanyakumari Diocese, who have come over here to convey the greetings of our Bishop. On behalf of CSI Institute of Technology, I extend a warm welcome to you, Pastor. Now I request our Principal, Dr. N.M. Spencer Pradap Singh, to honor our Pastor. Next, I would like to welcome our Administrative Secretary, Advocate as Dinesh, and Financial Administrator, Engineer as Baiju Nisitpal in their absence here. The challenge of leadership is to be strong, but not rude. Be kind, but not weak. Be bold, but not bully. Be thoughtful, but not lazy. Be humble, but not timid. Be proud but not arrogant. A good leader has the confidence to stand alone, the courage to make 
tough decisions and the compassion to stand, listen to the needs of others. He does not say to be a good leader, but become one, but the equality of his actions and the integrity of his intent. Here is our correspondent professor, Dr. Ian Ebenezer Joseph, who have vision and passion and not be able to afraid of any problem. Instead, he knows how to defeat it. He shows keen interest towards the development of our institution. On behalf of all assembled here, I welcome you, sir. Now I request our uh, principal, Dr. Uh, our bursar, Dr. Uh, Mr. Pun, Pun Solomon, to honor our correspondent. Excellence is never an accident. It is the result of high intention, sincere effort, intelligent direction, skillful execution, and the vision to see obstacles as opportunities. It is said that e-governance is easy governance, which paves the way for good governance. The man who paves the way for good governance and the Good Governance magazine identified him as E-People of the Year 2011. He is none other than our chief guest, Professor Moni Madhaswamy, Professor Emeritus and Chairman Kaz, Shobit Institute of Engineering and Technology, Meerut, UP, and former Director General, National Informatics Center, Government of India, New Delhi. He is a distinguished technocrat and eminent informatics scientist in the area of e-governance. He has visited many African, European, and Asian countries, including USA and Canada, on various technical missions. He has more than 40 years of experience in the field of e-governance and informatics, having held prestigious assignments, including sharing important responsibilities as Principal Systems Analyst to the former Finance Minister of India, Honorable Sri V.P. Singh, during the year 1985 to 1988. He is a great academician and received the Savaratna Award in 2004, Bugal Pushan Award in 2006, Global CEO Award in 2018, and Lifetime Achievement Award in 2021. It's a great privilege for us to have a great academician as our chief guest. On behalf of management, staff, and students, I extend a warm welcome to you, sir. Now I request our correspondent, Professor Dr. Ian Ebenezer Joseph, to honor our chief guest. It's better to lead from behind and put others in front, especially to celebrate victory when nice things occur. You take the front line when there is danger, then people will appreciate your leadership. Such a nice leader is our principal, Dr. N.M. Spencer Pradap Singh, who is a man with sincerity, dedication, and hardworking nature. On behalf of all assembled here, I welcome you, sir. Now I request Dr. T. Sajuraj, HOD, Department of CSC, to honor our principal. It's a part of good man to do great and noble deeds, though he risk everything. We have our bursar, Mr. Pun Solomon, who is a humble and noble man. 
On behalf of CSA Institute of Technology, I extend a warm welcome to you, sir. Now I request Dr. T. Jaya, HOD, ECE Department, to honor our bursar. It's my duty to welcome the pillars of our institution, the head of various departments, for their commitment, dedication, and hard work to excel our institution. I welcome Dr. T. Sajuraj, HOD, Department of CSE. Dr. T. Jaya, HOD, Department of ECE. Dr. K. P. Ajita Gladys, Department of Information Technology. Dr. A. Bindu, HOD, Department of Tripoli. <laughs> Dr. J. Branesh Robert, HOD, Department of Civil Engineering. Dr. S.L. Sango, HOD, Department of Mechanical Engineering. <laughs> Mr. P. Tilak Johnson, HOD, Department of Science and Humanities. Dr. D. Swaran Victor Snackson, HOD, Department of MBA. Mrs. M. Julie Emerald Jiju, HOD, Department of MCA. <laughs> Mr. J. Diamond, Office Manager. I would like to welcome our student secretary, Ms. P.J. Anusha, final year Tripoli, who is the overall topper of our college. I request our correspondent to honor our student secretary. It's the time to welcome our administrative committee members for their encouragement and guidance for the development of our institution. Next, I would like to welcome Mr. A. Nedinchalian, President, Thovalai Panchayat.
Mr. Thanu, Vice President, Tovalai Panchayat. It's a time to welcome the Organizing Secretary of Cultural Day, Mrs. M. Mahiba, Assistant Professor, Department of CC, uh, CSE. <laughs> Organizing Secretary of Sports Day, Mrs. D. Devashiba, Physical Directors, For the success of any mission, it's necessary to have good coordination. It's my duty to welcome the organizing committee members who contributed more for the successful conduct of the college day function. The strength of CSIIT is our staff members. It's my duty to welcome all the teaching and non-teaching staff members of CSIIT for their dedicated service. Education breeds confidence. Confidence breeds hope. Hope breeds peace. When learning is purposeful, creativity blossoms. When creativity blossoms, thinking emanates. When thinking emanates, knowledge is fully lit. When knowledge is lit, economy flourishes. It's my pleasure to welcome all my dear students of CSAIT who are the future pillars of India. It's often said that publicity can make or break any institution. Now I welcome press and media people who spread out the news to the community. Once again, I extend my warm welcome to one and all. Thank you. Welcome our organizing secretary, Dr. Shirley Kanagapriya, Assistant Professor, Department of Computer Science and in Engineering. I request Dr. A. Bindu, Department, Head of Department of Tripoli, to welcome her with a shawl. The assimilation of fine ideas treats towards character building, man-making and personality development. It is now only few-sided and all-round development. This is what CSI Institute of Technology endeavors to achieve. Now, let's have a glimpse of the ongoings of CSI Institute of Technology, the annual report for the academic year 2022-23. I request our beloved principal Dr. N. M. Spencer Pradab Singh to deliver the annual report. We are happy that Rev. Gilton Dayanand, Director, Department of Communication, CSI Kanyakumari Diocese, is in our midst. Now, our presidential address. Good morning to all. Due to official engagements, our bishop is not able to make an appearance at this College Day celebration. He amended the duty to read aloud in these greetings. On this 28th College Day celebration, I extend to you all my heartiest greetings on behalf of the Administrative Committee and the CSA Kanyakumar Diocese, respected Principal Dr. N. M. Spencer Pradap Singh, respected Correspondent Dr. N. Ebenezer Joseph, guest of honor of this day, Professor Moni Madaswamy, Professor Emeritus and Chairman of CAS, Sohit Institute of Tech Engineering and Technology, Muret, for his wonderful information he has gathered and he is very rich in his experience. I hope this day will be a good day for all the community. Nedin Zillian, the pre president of Tovale Panchayat, 
Mr. Thonu, the Vice President of Tovale Panchayat, beloved faculty members, HODs of the various departments, both teaching and non-teaching, and my beloved students. I think back this college humbles beginning on this particular day. The legacy of educating student community in the science and technology has started out in the year 1995 by preparing the students from the rural background. Its level of excellence in the field of science and technological education has exceeded. It is the pioneer and very first engineering college in the CSI. When we look back the history of education revolution in our district, the credit goes to the first Protestant missionary, Reverend William Tobias Ringel Tobey, who established seven churches and seven schools. In continuing the education mission, the Protestant missionaries laid the strong foundation for education. Reverend Charles Smith, Reverend Malt and other missionaries established uh, schools for, for the students from the rural area. The missionaries used education as a tool, tool to empower the people. Our missionaries opened the doors to the technical education by opening lace and printing technology in this part of the land. This institution on November 1st, 1995, the CSA Institute of Technology has started in this campus by Kanyakumari Diocese of the Church of South India, started with the three courses, mechanical, computer science, electrical and electronics. Now it has grown up to a higher level. This college is rec recognized as a testimony to the pioneer Christian missionaries untiring the selfless and devoted work. Education is a multi-stage process of building character, acquiring knowledge, improving skills for lifelong learning to lead a happy and peaceful life. Engineering education is a discipline, specific and outcome-based which involves the application of principles of mathematics and science to solve the practical engineering problems, to innovate newer technologies for providing feasible solutions to the futuristic challenges. This college was found with an observation to provide an excellent education, learning opportunity, opportunities to the students, and a great platform to showcase their skills. The institution has gone to a higher level with post-graduation courses as well as at the research level. The, the faculty members of these institutions are doing a very good job and dedicated, dedicated their time to encourage the students to learn in a wonderful way. Let us thank the faculty members for their wonderful effort and let us all strive hard together to provide an excellent education. Education is a powerful weapon which you can use to change the world. Education is a passport to the future because those who prepare for it today will have a better tomorrow. According to Proverbs chapter 9, verse 9 says that, Give instruction to a wise man and he will be still wiser. Teach a righteous man, he will increase in learning. As Nelson Mandela stated that, Education is the most powerful weapon with which you can change the world. Education is a tool that assists us in erasing all our doubts and anxieties regarding all life's obstacles and happiness. It is a tool that keeps us joyful and peaceful while also allowing us to better socialize with other people. Education is more than learning facts. It is also about learning how to be happy, how to be, keep others happy, how to live in the society, how to deal with challenges, how to help others, how to care the elderly people, and how to, live, how to live in the public. The college empowers the students from the rural background by providing them more control over their life, allowing them to make decisions on their own well-being and the future, which can lead higher self-esteem, confidence, as well as improved mental and physical health. This college has carved out a name for itself in the last 28 years of journey by delivering superior education for overall developments to its students. My best wishes to everyone on this college day. May the Almighty God bless our institution for providing great education and empowering the students from rural background. Best wishes to everyone. Thank you. Thank you, dear pastor. I call upon 
Mr. Nedun Chalian, President of Thowali Panchayat, to felicitate the gathering. CSI Engineer Kalli Rodaya, Yervatta Tade, Andilavel Kalandu Gundu, Wungalod, Nigalchil, Kalandu Guludar Kur, Waipat and the CSA Kaluri Nirua Turku, Thowala Urachi Sarbil, Manamaran and Dia Tirvitikula, Kadame Patulain. Yervatata, the Antibala will Kalanda Gundu Serapuce the Gundurka Kudia Serapu Urundinergal Kalerudia Talalar Kalerudia Mudalvar Kalerudia Pera Sirgal Kaluril Paniburium Saga Nanbergal Kaluril Pind. Varangala Til Natai Muneta Padaki Kundasala Kukudia Kalurundia Manavi Manavigalakum Yenod Ore than the Urachum Latunudia Tunetelever Maria de Kuria in Namdana or Lakum, the Neratil Murkan, Nandigan, the Wanakate with the Kundu Kadanda Irvate, Andigalakupinbu Irvata with the Kaluri Andula will Kalandulan into Nenekim Bolade. Unmelaye, Perimea de Kindadu Yen and the Sunal Kalur Nodea, Todaka Nigal Chium, Yanaki, Nandraga Terium Yervatata, the Andula will and Kalandu Golum Bolade, and the Kalatinodea, Nenevela, Manadil, Point the Kulakudia, Wai Pagatan, and Ide Kardigindin Adumatumalamal, the Nigal Chil Serapu Vernaraga Varitandula Maria de Kuria. Moni Madasami or Hill Nan Marambula, the Avril Path in Gavandin Avril Ayrati to Layrati, Yelavada Mande Aranya Anna Kaluri will paint Palvere, Padipula and Mudite, Palvere, Purupulake Alla Irkra in the Sunal, Unmele, Aurodia, Kartikale, Nam, Keke Vendam in the Enam in Manadi Ruladi Karanda Aimbada and Halamaga, Aurodia Kaluri Valkai. Not in the Kokudia, Palver, Podilk, Sentu and the Anuanga Ilam, Gay, Yuturika, Irikin, the Karnatinal, Ungalode, Yanakum, and the Karthikla Keka Vendomendori, Yenam, Yengal Kulazi. Yenum Sola Vendomendasona, and the Nigal Chil, Karandu Luderk, Unmele, Nate, Todaka Nigal Jinjulbu, Tunetele, Madiam or Gay, Varit and Daril. Anal in the Kale, Pera Serve in a Turundu, Kale, Patumaniki, Nigel Charabom, Marangal in the Sonargal, Unmele, Nangal, and the Nigel Chicaga, Patumanikul, Nigel Chi, Padumaniki, Urachimundatil Mati Vitri, the Nigel Chi, Kalandula Vendum in the Yenatilan, Gavandulin, Kalurudi, a pair CSA, Institute of Technology, Yeripedam Tovale, Gavarakudi, Athana, Pera Serlar Gatum, Kalurudi, a man of a man of a Gatum. Yengal Urachi Poilka Kudia, Pagodan, Ningal, Nge, Vandu Sidlik and Wood Kirigal. Agayal in the Kaluri Iki, Yenna Tevio, Yenbade, Yengal Urachiki, Ningal Torugundu, Terivital, Tovala, Vandu Sela Kudia, Anaitu Poilaku Mongolu, Teviana, Kori Kegel, and Nirvati Terwadarke, Urachi Mandatin Sarvil, Nangal, Tayara Rikrom, and Badin, the Niratilan, Terivitukula, Karame Patuli. Adamatamalamal Munburka Kudia, Kaluri, Mana, Marivulak, Admana, Vindu, and Nevada Sunal Pali, Padipa, Muritha Vite, Ningal Kaluri, Walkail, Pali Kailuk, Kalvi Kavila, Ningal, Vandu Lirgal Inda Idana made Lirka Kudia Munodi Alam, Kadanta Kalatil, our Kaluri, Walkay, Pindre, Indre Pera Siraga, Perum Madipukka Raga, the Made Lamander Kindaral. In the Mede, Indela, Indu, Indra, Urnal, Ningal Amara Kudi, Avahil, Ungalodi, a Kalvitarata, Ningal, Weir to Kola Vendo, Paluri, Pali, Kalvi and Badu, Uritani Ragam, Kaluri, Kalvi and Badu, Uritani Ragam, and the Kaluri, Walkail, Padika Kudia, Walkai Nudea, Pair Chidan, Ungalodi, a Walkaki Kundasala Kudia, Pairchi, Yanaway, the Pali, Pindu Kunduka Kudia, Mana, Mana will never know. Nalla Muril, Kalvi Katri, Warangala Til, India, Valinata Kudi, Vahil, Ungalodi, Yenangalai, Ningal, Titi, Nalla Padingal, Warangala Til, Ungalodi, Walkai, Muneta Makurkum, the Tiruvitakunde, 
நல்ல நிகழ்ச்சி நலத்தமைக்கு நன்றி கூறி விடைபெறுகின்றேன் நன்றி வணக்கம் தேங்க் யூ சார் ஃபார் யுவர் கைண்ட் வேர்ட்ஸ் ஆஃப் சப்போர்ட் நவ் லெட்ஸ் ஹாவ் அ கிளென்ஸ் ஆஃப் த ஆன் கோயிங்ஸ் ஆஃப் சிஎஸ்ஐ இன்ஸ்டிடியூட் ஆஃப் டெக்னாலஜி தி ஆனுவல் ரிப்போர்ட் ஃபார் த அகாடமிக் இயர் டுவெண்ட்டி டுவெண்ட்டி டூ ட்வெண்ட்டி ட்வெண்ட்டி த்ரீ ஐ ரிக்வெஸ்ட் அவர் பிலவட் பிரின்சிபல் டாக்டர் என் எம் ஸ்பென்சர் பிரதாப் சிங் டு டெலிவர் தி ஆனுவல் ரிப்போர்ட் ஆனுவல் ரிப்போர்ட் The CSA Institute of Technology is a Christian minority engineering college established in the year 1995 by the Church of South India, Kanyakumari Diocese, which is a pioneer in the field of education. I take immense pleasure in presenting a brief report on the noteworthy activities of our college during the academic year 2022-2023. I thank our Lord Almighty for showering His abundant grace and blessings upon us throughout this academic year our college has successfully completed 28 years of dedicated service in the field of technical education it has been spreading its fragrance of intellectual excellence in all spheres of education and also in extra curricular activities our institution offers engineering education in six different disciplines namely civil engineering computer science and engineering electrical and electronics engineering electronics and communication engineering mechanical engineering information technology at the, at the undergraduate level and eight different specializations of me mtech degree programs along with mca and mba at post graduate level with a total annual intake of 696 students the institution also offers research in the faculty of information and communication engineering it is proposed to start a new course on btec artificial intelligence and data science during the forthcoming academic year the college has excellent infrastructure facilities well equipped laboratories and library to impart sound education academic performance the performance of our students in the anna university examinations has been remarkable during the november december 2022 examinations technical symposium conference seminar and soft skill training the different departments of our college have organized a number of symposia seminars workshops conferences and guest lectures in which eminent resource persons were invited to deliver lectures and conduct practical sessions the department of mechanical engineering organized a national level technical symposium on 10th june 2022 the department of triple e organized employability skill development program on 25 8 2022 national technical symposium on 28 10 2022 and a three day workshop on design of pv system and monitoring of pv parameters using iot on 29 9 2022 14 2023 and 15 2023 the department of science and humanities organized a seminar on opportunities in government sector after graduation on 15 12 2022 by high tech ias ias academy chennai the department of cse organized a national level technical symposium lanista on 4 11 the department of ece organized a national conference and talent events rtece 2k3 on 6 3 the department of civil engineering organized a national level technical symposium cripido t 23 on 23 3 2023 The Department of Information Technology conducted a seminar on Spring Technology in Java on 18-11-2022 and a National Level Technical Symposium, Texina 2K23 on 31st March 2023. The Department of MCA organized hands-on workshop on Tally on 15-12-2023, a National Level Technical Symposium, Kaplanshaw 2K23 on 11th April 2023, and a one day workshop on full stack development on 19th april 2023 the department of management studies organized a college competition commemorating teachers day on 5th september 2022 poster making and business quiz competition on 3rd november 2022 business plan contest among the students on 21st november 2022 indoor college year talent fest on 26th april 2023 the industrial metaverse course hosted by the non mudalvan scheme was conducted at our college for 10 days by the experts from engage chennai around 100 students from our college and met engineering college had participated the training and got benefited 
Non Mudalvan scheme was coordinated by the spoke Dr. J. Ben Samuel, Assistant Professor, Department of Mechanical Engineering. Staff achievements. Appreciation to Dr. T. Jaya, Professor and Head Department of ECE, who has successfully guided six PhD scholars to obtain their doctorate degree during this academic year. Also, heartfelt appreciation to our college faculty members, Dr. J. Ben Samuel and Dr. M. John Prabhagar of Mechanical Engineering. Dr. D. Minola Davids of EC Department, Dr. G. Benny of IT Department, Dr. S. Jebastian Sudan Raja of Department of Management Studies, and Dr. J. Branish Robert of Department of Civil Engineering, who have completed their PhD degree during this academic year. Students' achievements. Our students have actively participated in the national, state-level seminars, symposium conducted by various institutions and won prizes under various categories. AGS, AGH Abhinesh and team of third year civil engineering won first prize in the National Level Project Expo held on 14-10-2022. M. Isai Bharat of second year MBA won first prize in text typing event conducted at 28th October 2022 organized by Annai Velangani College of Engineering. I Suvi 9 M. Isai Bharat of second year MBA won first prize in poster making event and in general quiz and second prize in data prediction event conducted on 28th October 2022, organized by Anne Velangani College of Engineering. I Suvin of second year MBA won second prize in poster presentation conducted on 10th November 2022, organized by St. Saviour's Catholic College of Engineering. Suvin I and Abhin M of second year MBA won first prize in business quiz contest held at RCET on 25th 2022. Moses Abraham Jai, uh, Rai M and Ajit B of first MCA won first prize in Tech Connect event as a part of National Level Technical Symposium held at Punchisli College of Engineering on 25th March 2023. Moses Abraham Rai M and the Barwin Raj of first MCA won second prize in the quiz contest conducted by the Rotaract Club of Scott Christian College Autonomous on 21-4-2023. Students from Information Technology underwent Implant training in the Indy Labs Technologies Chennai, Vibits Web Solutions Nagargoil, Asanjar Tengasi and Steps Software Solutions Chennai. Training and Placement Cell. We have a well-organized placement cell comprising of department placement offices headed by Dr. DSV Naxon, Head of Management Studies, who is the Chief Training and Placement Officer. An on-campus recruitment drive by Mrs. BSA Corporation was conducted on 10-11-2022 and students from different streams were participated. Training and Placement Cell has organized a job fair for CSE, IT and MBA which was conducted by Aravind Laboratories Chennai on 8-2-2023 and VA Microsystems Private Limited Chennai on 23-2-2023. Also, a campus recruitment drive in association with Banyan Technology Solutions was conducted on 24-3-2023. Totally, 129 students have been placed in various companies like BSA Corporation, Farisia Interior System, Pali Technologies Bangalore, Sanmina Technology, Olivia Constructions Private Limited, Aravind Laboratories, VA Microsystems, Connect Business Solutions Hyderabad, Lofty Optical, Axar Paints and Agni Steels, Science Club. 51 UG students had participated in the preliminary round of Precise Energy Olympiad conducted at in our college premises on 24-8-2022 by the Russian Center of Science and Culture Chennai. During the period from 17-10-2022 to 20-10-2022, the shortlisted students participated in the final round at Chennai and received appreciation award from the Kudangulam NPP region. This event was coordinated by Dr. S.R. Suram Samuel, Assistant Professor of EC Department for the benefit of students. Entrepreneurship Development Cell. Awareness program and journey on entrepreneurship was organized for the final year UG and PG students on 16-9-2022 and a seminar on various innovation schemes available in the Tamil Nadu Students Innovator TNSA Department was conducted on 15-2-2023. Around 80 students participated in the webinar on Step Out and Innovate, which was conducted virtually on 21st April 2023, commemorating World Creativity and Innovation Day. It was coordinated by Dr. DSV Naxon, HOD, MBA. Industrial Visit. All UG and PG students have been permitted to go for an industrial visit. 
Tutukorin Thermal Power Station, Kudangulam, Nuclear Power Station, Water Filter House. We receive this thousand per month from the state government. In our college, eight students are the beneficiaries of this scheme during this academic year. The merit come means National Scholarship Scheme. 67 students have been benefited and the post metric scholarship scheme. 69 students got their expenses from the government. The first graduate scheme are getting educational aid from the state government. The Diocese and Welfare Scheme, DWS, that is 69 student, poor students got educational support from the CSA Kanyakumari Diocese. In the BC Scholarship Scheme, 197 students have been enrolled. In the Prime Minister Scholarship for Military Men's Children under Exeris Scheme, 21 students had applied and more than 100 students had applied in different welfare schemes of the government. Sports and Games. The sports persons of CSIT have been consistently performing well since the inception of the college in the outdoor and indoor games like cricket, football, badminton, volleyball, kabaddi, chess and carom, apart from athletic events. Our physical directors, Mrs. T. Deva Shiba, provides special coaching to our students in all games as well as track and field events. Anna University Sona Level Volleyball Tournament was conducted at our college campus on 19-11-2022. Mr. S. J. Ajay, third year CAC has participated in the T20 Cricket Team Championship 2022 at Punjab, representing the Tamil Nadu team and won second place and he was honored by our correspondent on 17-8-2022. Women's tennis team won bronze medal in Anna University Sona 19 Table Tennis Tournament held at Stella Mary's College of Engineering held on 2-11-2022. Women volleyball team secured first place in Anna University Zone 19 Volleyball Tournament held at Layla Institute of Technology and Science held on 8-11-2022. Mr. S. Bismal Sejin of second year IT has participated in district level CM Trophy Badminton Tournament and secured first prize which was held on 7-3-2023. Mr. S. Arul Jo of Final Triple had participated in state level wrestling and secured second prize which was held on 19-3-2023. Our college women cricket team participated in the Interzone Cricket Tournament at Sivandhi Adithinar Engineering College, Tirchandur on 23-1-2023. Ms. Taniga from second year MCA, Mr. Anand S. from third year CSE, Ms. Ramya Jai from first MBA, Ms. Ponmalar from third year IT have won second prize. Yes, Sivabrinda of first CSC won first prize and Ms. Abida from first MCA won third prize in the Sona level athletic event hosted by the Anna University. Our college annual sports day was conducted on 27th April 2023 and Mr. S.A. Varsat National Badminton player graced the occasion as chief guest and the sports meet was declared open by him. National Service Scheme. The National Service Scheme of our college is coordinated by the NSS officer Dr. S. Jabastin Sudan Raja, assistant professor from the Department of Management Studies. In view of Independence Day, Indra College Year competitions were conducted on 15th August 2022 and the winners were awarded. At this juncture, the college appreciates the Scott Christian College Autonomous Nagargoil for conducting the NSS camp at our college campus from 27 to 2023 to 5 2023 and arranging special camp to clean our college campus. Youth Red Cross, Mr. Anbujo Marcel, Assistant Professor, Department of Science and Humanities, OERC Coordinator, organized awareness program on eye defects and consultation on 16-11-2022 and awareness program on drug abuse, Libertas on 7-3-2023. Many staff and students got awareness about eye defects and drug abuse. Faculty Development Program. Our college is the member institution of ICT Academy of Tamil Nadu and it helps our staff and students to update themselves about the recent advancements in technology. Under non mudulan scheme, 17 faculty members attended FTP during the art semester and 30, 13 faculty members during this event semester. Our college faculty members have participated in a six days FDP on research and innovation technologies from 6th March 2023 to 11th March 2023 organized by IET. Consultancy Services. Department of Civil Engineering has undertaken consultancy and testing of different types of structural elements for government and private organization. Mr. S.P. Sijidas, 
assistant professor of civil department is the faculty in charge of this testing unit library the library provides e journals as well as subscribed national and international journals our library is updated periodically by adding sufficient number of new books and there are more than 35000 volumes of books at present and tracking of books is managed with the help of autolib soft software laboratories cacit is a modernized campus with an installation of more than 500 computers in various departments with high speed internet connectivity the software laboratories machinery labs workshops and other advanced laboratories enhance the technical performance of our staff and students innovating testing equipment is also available in our laboratories to test and calibrate the components indian society for technical education the cacit staff advisor of iste students chapter mr j asli das assistant professor mca conducted a seminar on government job awareness program on 8 11 2022 connect to work on 18 11 2022 and a seminar on industry business and technology interdependence on 9 12 2022 alumni association the alumni association of our institution feels proud on seeing their successful alumni of its our great privilege to have global alumni network dr kp ajida gladys professor and head it has been nominated as the convener of the association transport facilities our institution operates a fleet of buses flying all over the district to cater the conveyance need of our students and staff. The transport wing functions under the control of Mr. Edwin Robert Singh, Assistant Professor Civil Engineering, who is the transport officer of our college. Hostels. Our college is equipped with fully furnished separate hostel facilities for both boys and girls inside the campus. Mr. M. Austin Jani, Assistant Professor Tripoli, is acting as Deputy Warden in the Men's Hostel and Mrs. T. Deva Shiba, Physical Directors is acting as Deputy Warden in the Ladies' Hostel. The hostels are specially designed with the primary objectives of safety and comfort. It has round-the-clock security with stringent security procedures, also conducive to the mental, physical and spiritual development of the students and helps them become self-reliant. The hostel prayer cell supports the inmates to grow spiritually and psychologically well. Youth programs and prayer cell. The students are actively engaged in spiritual atmosphere by participating in divine worships and various programs in the campus of CS Institute of Technology. The college prayer cell coordinator, coordinator Mr. D. Sur Daniel Suresh, Assistant Professor Mechanical Engineering, provides spiritual guidance in shaping our students' attitude and character. A well-organized college choir exists for both staff and students under the direction of Mr. S. Bennett Charles, Assistant Professor MCA. Musical instruments such as keyboard, guitar are available in the chapel for spiritual nourishment. Nair Yuva Gendra and Youth Resource Center, Kanya Kumari, an autonomous organization under the Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports, Government of India, organize training in youth leadership and community development, TYLCD, within our campus for three days from 26 to 2023 to 28 to 2023. Mrs. R. Marina Quindin, Assistant Professor of Tripoli Department, coordinated the event successfully. A special song was sung by the college choir, staff choir on the Christmas season, and it was telecasted in, in Heaven TV and other social medias. Our college choir received first prize from the Heaven TV official YouTube for obtaining more number of views. Co-curricular and extracurricular activities. The students are encouraged to participate in various cultural programs and quiz competitions on and off campus to develop and exhibit their talents and skills. All in the radio sponsored Kaluri Galata live stream program was teleca telecasted from the college campus on 24 11 2022 by the All in the Radio officials along with our first year B, B Tech and MCA students. This program was coordinated by Mr. P. Tilak Johnson, HOD of Science and Humanities. Enrolling of new OTS ID was coordinated by Mrs. Angel Punida, Assistant Professor of Mathematics on 25-11-2022 and the VO of Chandra Mudur had participated in the event. An educational movie, Karuna Illam, was displayed to the students on 31-2023 as per the information received from the District Collectorate, Nagar Goyal. This program was coordinated by Mr. Selvin Prem Kumar, Assistant Professor of CSE. Unimoney Financial Services conducted Passport Mela on 27th March 2023 at our college campus, coordinated by Mrs. 
is a don and angel assistant professor of triple e and more than 50 staff and students got benefited benefited through this event internal quality assurance iqac steps are being taken for the institution to get accredited by nac and nba dr c harriet linda assistant professor csc and dr s wilfred franklin professor ec are acting as the iqac coordinators for the college along with the department coordinators graduation day and freshers day 23rd graduation day was held on 22nd october 2022 and an eminent personality professor dr v s elizabeth vice chancellor of tamil nadu national law university was the chief guest addressed the gathering and distributed the degree certificates to the students 28th freshers day was celebrated on 11th november 2022 and advocate in talavai sundaram mla was the chief guest advocate or magesh mayor nagargol corporation was the guest of honor advocate s dinesh administrative secretary csa kanyakumari diocese felicitated the gathering cultural day the cultural committee convener mrs m magiba assistant professor csc along with the department cultural coordinators organized annual indra collegiate cultural festival on 28th april 2023 and mr m Rose Cyril Xavier, former Assistant General Manager BSNL Nagargoyal, was the Chief Guest for the Cultural Day, College Day. The 28th College Day is being joyfully celebrated on 29-4-2023 in a grand manner under the presidentship of our Bishop, Right Rev. Dr. A.R. Chelaya, Rev. Gilden, Department of Communication Ministries, Kanyakumari Diocese, and to be felicitated by Advocate S. Dinesh, Administrative Secretary, CSA Kanyakumari Diocese, Engineer S. Baiju Nisid Pal, Financial Administrator, CSA Kanyakumari Diocese, Administrative Committee Members of CSA Kanyakumari Diocese, Mr. Nedinjalian of Thowalai Panjayat President, Mr. Nam Thanu, Vice President of Thowalai Panjayat, Prof. Dr. N. Ebenezer Joseph, Correspondent, CSIT, and Mr. Pun Salomon, Barsar, CSIT, Prof. Moni Madasami, Prof. Emeritus and Chairman, Center for Agricultural Informatics, and e-governance research studies, Sobit Institute of Engineering and Technology, Meerut, Uttar Pradesh, and former Director General, National Informatics Center, Government of India, New Delhi, is the chief guest for the function. The college annual magazine for the academic year 2022-23 is to be released on this occasion. Hearty congratulations to the chief editor, Dr. S. Jabastin Sudan Raja, Assistant Professor from the Department of Management Studies and his team for the successful completion of this magazine work. The best cover design created for the, created for the college magazine, Techno, Technonicals 2023 by Engineer I. Suvin of Final Year MBA is being appreciated. Prices are given for the university rank holders, academic topics and the students who won prizes in various cultural and literary events on this occasion. The word of thanks is to be proposed by the student secretary, Ms. P.J. Anusha, final triple E, who is the overall academic topper of our institution. The college day is being well organized by Dr. P. Shali Kanagapriya, assistant professor from the department of CSE, who is the organizing secretary of the college day celebrations for this academic year. Obituary. We are very much grieved over the sudden demise of Mr. Sajan Rajesh, assistant professor, and former head department of mechanical engineering on 13 to 2023 csit remember his dedicated service may his soul rest in peace and may the lord console the bereaved family conclusion i extend my gratitude to the management in general and in particular to our chairman come bishop of csa kanyakumari diocese right reverend dr a r chelaya who is a source of inspiration I sincerely thank our correspondent professor, Dr. N. Ebenezer Joseph, a dynamic and eminent personality, a man of understanding and foresight for his guidance in running this institution. His guidance and prayerful efforts contributed a lot for the fast growth of this institution. I also thank our Barsar, Mr. Pun Salomon, for managing the duties connected with the financial matters. Also, I thank our college chaplain, Reverend P. Nelson, for the cooperation and encouragement extended towards the spiritual growth of this institution. I take this opportunity to, to thank the head of departments, faculty, staff and students for their full cooperation extended to me throughout this year in the smooth functioning of this prestigious institution. 
I wholeheartedly appreciate our students for their good behavior and excellent academic performance. Finally, let me conclude this annual report by invoking the God Almighty to lead this institution for His glory in the forthcoming years. We hope to continue this journey with the, with the guidance of God, cooperation of parents, well wishes, present and former professors, alumni, staff, students and management. All the best for the next academic year 2023-24. I am Spencer Pradab Singh, Principal in Charge. Thank you. Thank you, sir. We all feel very dignified to be a part of CSI IT family. Now, it is the time to release annual magazine of CSI Institute of Technology. May I invite Dr. S. Jebastin Sudan Raja, Assistant Professor, Department of Management Studies, who is the Chief Editor for the annual magazine Technicals 2023 to hand over the magazine to a honorable chief guest. May I humbly request our chief guest, Professor Mani Madhaswamy, to release the annual magazine. First copy of the magazine will be received by Dr. N. Ebenezer Joseph, correspondent of CSI Institute of Technology. Second copy of the magazine will be received by Mr. Pon Salomon, Bachelor of CSI Institute of Technology. The final year students from all disciplines of a college were placed in the campus recruitment conducted on various days. I now call upon Mrs. Deva Kruba Dani, Assistant Professor of Computer Science and Engineering, to announce the names of the students who are placed. May I request our Chief Guest, Professor Mani Madhaswamy, to issue the job offer letters. We are extremely happy and proud to announce that our final year students have been placed in various companies like Connect Solutions, Olivia Constructions, Sanmina Technology, Wipro Infrastructure, BSA Corporation, Haura and VI Microsystem during the placement drives conducted in our college. We, the CSITNs, congratulate and wish them all success in their future endeavors. Today, out of 83 students, 56 are receiving their orders in, in person. Department of Civil Engineering, Genu Yes. Department of Computer Science Engineering, Alan Paul Thomas. T. Anish Arukya Roshida Ashiga Ashwida A. Babisha Blessly Nishifa C. Selin Rose Dina Edwin Raj Gordon Saji Liju, Liulin Shamli, Bubalan, T. Anish, Aroke Roshida. Ashika Ashwita Ye Babisha Blessly Nishifa Selin Rose Dina, Edwin Raj, Gordon Saji George, Liju, Liulin Shamli, 
பூபாலன் சத்யா ஸ்மித் ஆஷாபியா ஜெர்லி நிஷா லெட்டிஜா லித்தியா சௌபர்ணிகா சூரியகலா Department of Electrical and Electronics Engineering Altrin Gino Anusha அனுஷா பிஜே ஜீவானந்த் மேரி கிரேஸ்லின் மெல்பிட் ஜோ ஷிஜு அபினேஷ் ஆண்டனி ரொனால்ட் Department of Electronics and Communication Engineering Anne Stephie A Ashika Danish Jaren Moni Shibia Department of Mechanical Engineering Abhinesh Abhino Abhish Kumar Ajay Anish Ishant Gordon Wesley Gol Marvin Jebin Jafin Christo Janish Rahul Stainsley 
ബിജു Department of Information and Technology Ajin LC Manisha Gayatri Ishia Jaba Shiba Priya Kala Srishma Thank you ma'am. I wish all the students a bright future. The admiration of genius makes one aspire for excellence in life. Examples moves the world more than doctrine. Knowledge shared is knowledge squared. Such a knowledgeable person is our chief guest, Professor Mani Madhaswamy, Professor Emeritus and Chairman CAIRS and former Director General National Informatics Center, Government of India, New Delhi, to deliver the Chief Guest Address.